battle, perhaps the most significant battle yet with ISIS now underway. And new details this morning as the Iraqi military continues its battle for the northern town of Mosul. They're trying to recapture the Iraq's second largest city from ISIS. A terror group has controlled the town for more than two years. It's last stronghold in Iraq. Uh, but now there's word that ISIS may unleash chemical weapons and retaliation, said to be 4,000 fighters at least in that city. Connor Powell live in a Middle East Bureau now with more on how likely is the threat that ISIS could use chemical weapons. Connor? Well, enough that the U.S. military is concerned about it. The Pentagon has said uh, in briefing journalists that of that sort of four to 5,000 or so ISIS fighters in Mosul, they expect and believe many of them are, in fact, foreign fighters. They think these are the most extreme fighters, the ones who are willing to do just about anything. There are already reports that they are gathering civilians around uh, ISIS positions to protect them, using them as human shields. There are also reports and fears that ISIS will use chemical weapons. Uh, in the past few weeks, Pentagon officials say they've collected evidence of a sulfur mustard agent on spent shells in and around Mosul. So there is a fear that ISIS does have their hands on some chemical weapons and they are practicing, they're trying to figure them out. The good news though, Bill, according to Pentagon officials, is they think that ISIS's knowledge and understanding of how to use chemical weapons is fairly rudimentary. Still, given the fact that ISIS is trying to figure out how to use them, that is a big concern for both U.S. and Iraqi forces pushing in on Mosul. American Defense Secretary said the U.S. commitment to defending South Korea was unwavering and included, quote, extended deterrence guaranteed by the full spectrum of U.S. defense capabilities. Make no mistake, any attack on America or allies, by our allies will not only be defeated, but also any use of nuclear weapons will be met with an overwhelming and effective response. This video, I announce my separation from the United States. both the military but economic also so please uh, you have another problem of economics in my country I have separated from them so I will be dependent on you for all time but do not worry we will also help as you help us 